Hi everyone, Lucy here from Forest City Stitching. It is day 15 of Flossmas, so December 15th, 2021. Got a cattail. Hope everyone had a good day. A pretty really good day actually, so that's a nice change in how I've been feeling lately. So, um, yeah, so just at work today, last night, um, my son and I, we watched A Boy Named Christmas. Um, that was a recommendation from Anna. Why can't I think of her floss tube? right now. Stitch Rosies. Oh boy, that was hard. Um, she had mentioned it on her last floss too, so we checked that out last night, and it was good. All right, got this ad uh, from the Lindor Advent, and then the tea is Organic Nine Berries, so there's lots of berries in there. Stuck together, smells good. It's gonna be really hot. too hot to taste the flavor. Still a little hot. Nine berries. Organic elderberries, organic aronia berries, organic hibiscus, Organic jun juniper berries, organic sweet blackberry lilies, organic chicory root, organic strawberries, organic black currants, organic sea buckthorn berries, natural berry flavoring, organic raspberries, organic gojo berries, and organic blueberries. And so it's a fruit inf fruit infusion. I didn't know there were so many berries I didn't know about. Yeah, I'm really excited about this for the Forbidden Fiber Co. event because I have no idea what this is. Oh, and it's really tied together. It's a velvety container. Create your own magic. Yule is a time of myth and magic. Even if you don't get the opportunity to celebrate the Yule season, remember to create your own magic every day. Oh, it's a pop socket. Hmm. I've never had one of these. So you put it on the back of your phone, right? Then it can be a stand, right? And you can hold it like this. Maybe I'll go check. And now someone is deciding to groom himself right in the corner of the video. I'm sorry. Hey, right. well, that's something I didn't have. So I'm getting lots of things I didn't have, so that's good. Um, today I went and picked up my floss for the Modern Folk Embroidery Cell from Every Coat. Um, I'm lucky enough that I live in London, so I live in the same city as Caroline, and I work like walking distance from her shop. So I place an order, I just walk over there at lunchtime and pick it up. So I got grunge to do my modern folk embroidery sow in. And then I got to meet Hannah today because Caroline was pulled away. And so Hannah brought out my floss. So that was exciting because she's gonna be my roomie at Stitch North. And I hadn't met her. So I don't know if this is, you can see all the different variations in that 
but blue and greeny gray. So I just thought that would give it a bit of interest other than just black. But I think the chalkboard black is pretty variegated if I'm remembering correctly. It has some gray hues in it. So I'm all set for that. Um, I am off work next week, so I'm hoping one day to get to Stitch It Central to pick out some fabric for that and for a few other projects. I did get a little bit of, a little bit. Oh, we're from Anne Morrison too, but she's upstairs, so maybe if I remember I'll bring that down tomorrow. So I worked on so this color is actually going to be part of, so it was this very variegated color that we got yesterday. And so there's going to be a border all around, inside and outside of this. So you can kind of see it there along the fence post. A different variegation. And then I did grab just a couple lips here to show because another sour I want to start is the new linen and threads um, stitch along, which I think is, I don't know what he's calling it, but it has to do with seasons. So. Um, so this is the 2019. my progress. I'm ripping out these butterflies. Ripping out these butterflies. Um, so I just have the bottom two corners to do, which is a lot more kind of backstitching than crosses. So I, it'll be on my little board for a finish. And hopefully I'll be able to get it complete this year. And then, this is the 2020 Friends and Family. Oops. Apparently I'm losing the floss. And that's how far I'm on that. Not super far. <laughs> As you can tell. It was on my whipcord board to finish a section, um, but I don't think I actually did that one. <laughs> all right, so I think that's all I have for today. It's always wandering around, now shaking. He goes to the vet tomorrow for a checkup. I think the vet's going to say that he needs to lose some weight, which would not be untrue. And yeah, all right, we will see you tomorrow. Bye.